The XFL made an announcement. Actually, the XFL and the NFL made a joint statement together. And basically, it outlined how the XFL will test new ideas for the NFL. That's new rules, that's equipment, that's safety measures, officiating, all kinds of stuff. They're going to be a test bed for new NFL ideas. I made a connection when The Rock was on the field at the Super Bowl introducing the LA Rams and the Cincinnati Bengals, I said, hmm, remember, that's, John, that's not just The Rock, the American actor, the star of Fast and Furious and Moana and all kinds of stuff. That's also The Rock, XFL owner, The Rock, introducing the Super Bowl. I was like, huh. That points towards a collaboration potentially between the NFL and the XFL. They're already working together. You would have never seen the former owner of the XFL Vince McMahon <laughs> at the Super Bowl introducing the Rams or the Bengals. I was like, huh, that's interesting. And so when this got announced, a lot of people sent me messages on Instagram. They're like, hey, Zach, you called it. Look, you're right. The XFL and the NFL are collaborating. And I, I appreciate the messages. I, I think th there was a breadcrumb there, right? There was a clear, why is the XFL owner introducing the Super Bowl. There's more going on here than, than just that. So, especially because it felt a little bit out of place, a little weird, like a little bit forced. Now, I love the XFL. The XFL is, it was, you know, 2020 was a very, very hard year. The XFL was probably my favorite thing from that year. I went to a lot of XFL games in 2020 before the Rona shut the league down. It was great football. I loved evaluating the quarterbacks. Josh Johnson was incredible there. Um... I traveled to New York. I went to a New York Guardians game. I went to a lot of games in Seattle. I traveled the country. I went to XFL games. I got access there. They were great to me. I thought it was a wonderful opportunity for young players to put stuff on film and also get paid. And it was sad. It was so heartbreaking. The XFL was doing very, very well until the Rona derailed it and kind of destroyed the league. And it felt very unfair at the time. I was like, man. If only this once-in-a-lifetime thing hadn't happened, the XFL probably would still be here and still going. The overtime rules were fun, and what, what's happening here is that partnering with the XFL brings, partnering with the NFL, excuse me, brings the XFL closer to being an official minor league of the NFL, which I love that. Uh, I think that's good, because you can either work with the NFL or against the NFL. There isn't really another option. And despite a lot of people's, uh, I think, the illusion and the, the, the silly idea that the XFL could actually dethrone the NFL. Like some people hate the NFL and they're like, oh, the XFL is great. Let's watch the XFL instead. That's a small minority of people. The XFL is never going to dethrone the NFL. Like taking the NFL head on, head on to be incredibly stupid for The Rock and his team there uh, running the XFL and developing the XFL. I think if you can use the NFL for funding and collaborate with them, the XFL is more likely to survive if they can bring value to the NFL. The NFL wouldn't be competing against them. They would probably give them funding and money and help them. Uh, so I think it's a great move for the XFL for the stability and survivability of the XFL. They have to be on the same side as the NFL collaborating with them. It's going to give them a lot better opportunity to make it and survive long-term as a league. And I think there's a market here where... I think there's a need, not only an opportunity for players to show what they can do, but it's good for the development of the game. It's good for young players to get an opportunity, to get better, for backups who don't play all year to finally play in real live game reps. Um, it could potentially replace the preseason. It could be uh, a place for the NFL to test new rules and equipment and ideas. Like it's, it's actually wonderful. Again, bringing value to the NFL really helps the XFL, and uh, I love, love, love to see a potential collaboration, or actually, I guess, a confirmed announced collaboration between the NFL and the XFL.